remain. But based upon these advances and on the significant cost of our current policy, it is time, after 10 long years, to begin the drawdown process. Mr. President, I would yield the floor and note the absence of a quorum. Clerk will call the roll. Mr. Akaka. Senator from Pennsylvania. I would ask that the quorum call be vitiated. Without objection. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent that the Judiciary Committee be discharged from further consideration of SRS 202 and the Senate proceed to its consideration. The clerk will report. SRS 202 designating June 27, 2011 as National Post Traumatic Stress Disorder Awareness Month. Without objection, the, the committee is discharged and the Senate will proceed to the measure. I ask unanimous consent the resolution be considered. Uh, the Conrad Amendment, which is at the desk, be agreed to. The resolution as amended be agreed to. The preamble be agreed to. The motion to reconsider be laid upon the table with no intervening action or debate. And any statements related to the matter be placed in the record as if read. Without objection. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent of the uh, Senate proceed to the immediate consideration of SRS 212, which was submitted earlier today. The clerk will report. SRS 212, congratulating the people and government of the Republic of Slovenia on the 20th anniversary of the country's independence. Without objection, the Senate will proceed to the measure. Mr. President, I further ask that the resolution be agreed to, the preamble be agreed to, the motion to reconsider be laid upon the table with no intervening action or debate and that any statements related to the measure be printed in the record at the appropriate place. Without objection. Mr. President, I ask unanimous consent that when the Senate completes its business today, it adjourn until 9.30 a.m. on Wednesday, June 22nd, that following the prayer and the pledge, the journal of proceedings be approved to date, the morning hour be deemed expired, and the time for the two leaders be reserved for the use later in the day that following any leader remarks, the Senate be in a period of morning business till 11 a.m. with senators permitted to speak therein for up to 10 minutes each, with the time equally divided and controlled between the two leaders or their designees, with the majority controlling the first half and the Republicans controlling the final half, that following morning business, the Senate resume consideration of the motion to proceed to S-679, the Presidential Appointment Efficiency and Streamlining Act. Without objection. Mr. President, we are working on an agreement for consideration of the Presidential Appointment Efficiency and Streamlining Act. We will notify senators when votes are scheduled. Mr. President, if there's no further business to come before the Senate, I ask that it adjourn under the previous order. The Senate stands adjourned until 9.30 a.m. tomorrow. So the Senate scambled out, but earlier today, members approved the nomination of Leon Panetta